Two children were hit last night by a car near Florist in Tetonia. The driver took off. Now, police say they are looking for this car, which is possibly a red Honda Civic or a Cord. Lauren Renfrey has the latest on this investigation. This is where it happened near this busy intersection where it isn't unusual to see cars speeding. I spoke with one man who shared his interesting perspective. He says the issue isn't reckless driving, it's people living recklessly. As investigators piece together the moments that led to yet another hit and run involving children, bystanders like Alan Jones wonder who will be next. It could have been my kids or anybody else's kids in the neighborhood. It's, and it's sad that, that this stuff is happening. Jones works in transportation and sees it all the time. Drivers not obeying the rules of the road. A lot of speed, a lot of just jumping in front of cars. See it every day. In this latest incident, police say a car sped around a parked school bus and headed straight for a group of four children, seriously injuring a four and six year old. Jason, why do you think reckless driving is such a problem in Milwaukee? Well, it's to me, it's, it's not reckless driving, it's reckless living. You see what I'm saying? It's more than just people out here driving crazy. We just seeing a result of the breakdown of the family. Far, a father himself says it's even harder to believe this hit and run happened on the same day two little girls were laid to rest after being killed in an incident similar to this one less than two weeks ago. Police say they're looking for a red or burgundy Honda Civic or Accord with black wheels and they're asking anyone with information to call them. Reporting near Florist and Tetonia, Lauren Winfrey, today's TMJ4.